And welcome back to Let's Play Harvest Moon Hero Fleet Family. Guess what? It's Charles's birthday today. Let's go give him a present. But yeah, it's actually not Liar's Day yet. Liar's Day is on the 23rd. It's still the 22nd. It's weird. Liar's Day is kind of weird in terms of how it's displayed on the calendar, but you'll see. Either way, it's not Liar's Day until tomorrow, so we have plenty of time to prepare. And by prepare, I mean do absolutely nothing, because there's no preparing for Liar's Day. Anyways, let's make Charles a nice hot cake. So what do you think he would like? I know, let's put a good eel in there. Uh, some scrap metal. And, I don't know, maybe a nice root. That sounds like it would make a good cake. Perfect. Got ourselves a nice present for Charles. We'll find him later. Anyways, let's get to work. Oh, hi Joe. Oh. Okay, well, yeah, so there's a new ending path. And it has to do with fishing. That's not true. Uh... Ponte likes to fish. Okay, yeah, he's probably right that we're the only ones who like to fish here. Sure, why not? We can use any way to save the town. Alright, so we just need to meet him at the lake at some time, or at some point. We have plenty of time until the next event happens, so we don't really have to worry about that for now. Basically, all we need to have done is basically fish since we met him. Hi, doggy. Anyways, let's go take care of the animal, shall we? Let's also not give the failed dish to the dog. That is for Charles. And only for Charles. Also, let's find out one more thing. How are you feeling? You're absolutely fine. Okay, apparently we can just leave our animals outside in snowy days. That's good to know. Probably would have been better to know if I had tried to, you know, test this, like, way earlier in the season, but whatever. So yeah, from now on, I guess I'll try to leave my animals outside during the snow. See if they get sick or not. I really hope they don't get sick. Although we usually get at least one day's warning if they're going to get sick or not. They always become unhappy first and then sick, I think. Like I said, in this game it's surprisingly hard to get your animals sick. I don't think I've ever actually seen them get sick before. Then again, it might be the opposite for our character, because usually our character is really easy to get sick. And the animals are hard to get sick, but it might be reversed for some reason when I'm playing this game in this playthrough. Because so far we cannot get sick. But maybe the animals can. I really hope they don't, though. I always feel bad whenever that happens. So we'll get all the milk, all the uh, eggs, get all the crops watered, go see Charles, and then... There's nothing else we really need to do today, because yeah, Liar's Day isn't until tomorrow. Uh, let me just milk this cow. There we go. Yeah, there's nothing else we could really do today. We might just call it a super early day, just so I can get to Liar's Day. Also, the fuel looks really weird when, like, a fifth of it is missing. Then again, Disneyland might like the extra space. I don't know. I'm not sure if cows like tall grass or not. I'm assuming they don't really care about it, honestly. Actually, I assume they like short grass, just because it doesn't, like, have a ton of bugs in it. Then again, it is winter, so there probably aren't any bugs in that tall grass anyways. Man, could you imagine if you had to deal with, like, insects taking over your crops in this game? Anyways, uh, let's just finish up over here. And yeah, we'll go find Charles. I don't actually know Charles' schedule on Sunday, so... We're just gonna have to wander around the valley until we find him. I am gonna find him today, though. It's his birthday. We have to wish him a happy birthday. Whether or not he likes it, or not. That was a weird way of phrasing that, whatever. Let's get out of here. Also... Stop standing on top of the dog's food dish. That is extremely rude. Oh, that would be a terrible place for your horse to just rest. Right on top of the, where the dog wants to eat. Alright. So let's go try the Funland offices first, I guess. 
That's usually where he hangs out. And by hanging out, I mean works. Usually a good place to find where, uh, where a person is if you go to where they work. Then again, it is the weekend, so he's a day off. Oh, we can also go see the Harvest Goddess later. I think it's still a bit too early, though, so we'll come back. Oh! Oh, hi, Alice. We actually caught you outside for once during the weekend. Man, that must be pleasant. I don't even know if we have heating in our house. Oh my god. Do they have a self-destruct mechanism in their house or in their uh, building? If we could find that, could we activate it and blow them all up? That would solve all our problems. It would also be murder, so let's not do that. Here, instead, let's just make sure we give her a mineral crystal and make her like me more. Also, yes, they are still planning to build even more robots. How much money do you people spend on those things? I keep breaking them. Uh, let's see. Ren's out here, but I don't see Charles anywhere. Oh, we can't go inside the offices during the weekend. Could have sworn you couldn't. Charles, are you in here? Yes, you are. But I have your birthday present. Happy birthday! But it's your... Fine. Take it anyways. No, okay. Yeah, she won't even accept it. Just take it. I really wish we could put him on camera for that. Oh well. We tried, but he was extremely rude. Oh well. We could go mining later. Yeah, I don't know how to shovel snow either, but that's more because of the area I live in. It's not It never snows here, so I don't really know how to deal with it. Anyways, let's give the Harvest Goddess something. Uh, what do I have that she would like? I have a ton of berries. More berries, then. And yeah, I also want to go check out Alice's heart level when I get back home. I want to get along with... Honestly, I kind of want to get along with my dog better at this point. It's always good to uh, get along with your dog. Alright, uh, what time is it? It's not noon yet, but... It's another hour until noon. You know what? I'm gonna go sell my stuff tomorrow. Let's just head home and go to bed. I know I'm going to bed super early, but I just want to make sure I squeeze in tomorrow into this episode. And I don't want this episode to go too long. So, bedtime? Bedtime. I just slept for what? Nearly 20... I think we did sleep for 20 hours. We were only up for 4 hours. Yeah, we went... Or 19 hours, I guess. Alright, let's get out there. Here we go. It's Liar's Day. So yeah, even though it's basically the day after Sunday, it's still Sunday. The game considers it Sunday. Which is why that slash was on Sunday for two days. But yeah, Liar's Day is basically everyone gets to lie their butts off. Don't believe anything you hear on Liar's Day. Anyways, let's uh, grab our milk. Grab our eggs, get everything watered, and then we'll head to town and see what's going on. I mean, no one will lie to us, right? We're their friends, we're trying to save the valley. There are some characters who won't lie, though, I think. I don't know, actually. Maybe I'm lying. Anyways, we'll get everyone milked. Yeah, I'll have to make sure I sell all this stuff again. Oh, right, it's Sunday. Again. So the uh, grocery store is closed. Yeah, they weren't kidding about the fact that it's Sunday again. It is, in fact, still Sunday. You know what? What if it wasn't actually Liar's Day? What if we just went to bed for like an hour and just got up and thought it was Liar's Day? That would be an awesome practical joke. I think. It might also just be horrible. Why can't I ride my horse? There we go. I'll come back for the eggs. Here.
You can also water our crops. You know what? I'm not gonna water the tomatoes anymore. I don't think- Actually, we might be able to squeeze in one more tomato harvest before the end of the season. Yeah, I think we'll be able to, like, squeeze in one more. We'll make sure we water them, though. But you know who will never lie to me? My horse. Because he can't talk. Yet. He might be able to talk later in the game if we get to know him well enough. Anyways, tomatoes with all these watered. God, I forgot how much breadfruit I planted. Every single time I see this field, I... Uh, I'm a little sad just because I planted so much breadfruit and nothing else. I could have planted so many more colorful crops, but no, it had to be breadfruit. I'm very bitter against breadfruit. I hate breadfruit. There we go. Alright, that's watered. Let's get out of here. No, let's get out of here. Stop running away from me. Alright, let's go see what's happening around town. Ooh, rabbit. Man, can't wait until we get a rabbit on the farm. Rabbits are adorable. Oh, it's Tim. Oh, it's... Why do you even have this field, by the way? You're not even planting anything here. Are you lying? Are you saying that it's not a good thing that to meet me first thing in the morning? That's really dangerous information. Thanks for that. Ah, uh, gotta love Liar's Day. Everyone's lying to us. But yeah, does that mean that he actually doesn't like me and doesn't want to meet me in the morning? I don't know who to trust anymore today. I can trust Katie though, right? No, that's just Charles. But yeah, I do like this holiday. Everyone has like funny little stories or like little lies to tell you. No, oh. except for Wallace. Unless he's lying and is lying to me right now. Do we trust Wallace? Eh. Yeah, everyone has a couple of different lying lies. Lying lines. And some characters just won't lie because they're too serious. I wonder if Charles is a... Or not Charles, uh... I'm pretty sure Charles doesn't lie. Wonder if Chester's around. Yep, there he is. Hi, Chester. Okay, are you saying that's not good to see me so energetic? Or are you saying... Tell me about Liar's Day. Ah. So basically it was because the king wasn't very bright. So yeah, that's the origin of Liar's Day. I don't know- if, okay, no, I know for a fact that that is not a lie. No. No, that does not make sense, Chester. You tried. You tried, buddy. Some people are better at this than others. Okay, seriously, why does everyone hate me this morning? Also, tell me about Liar's Day. Okay, yeah, you're just gonna repeat the same story. Okay, I don't know how to believe my calendar anymore. Someone wrote this date, said this day had two... This... Someone said there were two Sundays in a row. Alright, let's get out of here. But man, everyone's just insulting me this morning. Fine, I didn't like any of them anyways. Alright, I 
Actually, I forget. Does the Harvest Goddess also uh, participate? Let's find out, shall we? Let's give her a tomato. She likes it when I throw in crops that I have actually grown myself. Oh, uh, get along with dogs, I guess. Nah. Okay, yeah, she's not participating. Unless I give her something else. How would she like a berry berry? No, okay, yeah. I figured she wouldn't participate. Let's go see if anyone else will. Oh, let's go check out the uh, Funland people. See what they're up to. Oh, oh, it's Charles, my best. Nope, can't do it. Hi, Charles. Nah, he's just gonna be a jerk about it. Fine, let's go. Oh, they're locked. Darn it. Actually, Ren's probably out and about somewhere. We'll go find him. If I can get on my horse. Charles, let me get on my horse. Oh my god. This is why I don't like you. Alright, let's see if we can find the sweet spot. There we go. Actually, is Rudolph back yet? I know he left for a day to get, uh, basically take care of the fossil, but I believe he's back now, right? Nope. He's not here. Man, we'll find him in the valley somewhere. But man, if you could you imagine if there were really two Sundays in a row at anywhere? That would throw everything off for everyone. Oh, Ren can't have fun. I blame Charles. All right. But yeah, the Funland people aren't going to really participate. They're kind of legally, I guess not legally obligated, but like professionally obligated not to do it. Hi, Woody. Uh, honestly, I wouldn't doubt you about Kurt, Joe, maybe. Well, no, Kurt, maybe he would be a wooden doll. Okay, Woody, this is starting to get a bit out of hand. I'm not sure if that was a lie or if he actually believes that. I know, Rudolph. I would honestly not doubt that either. Man, a lot of these lies, if you actually take them on non-Liars Day, they could actually be true. Also, I think we need to take care of Rudolph. Yeah, Kurt doesn't participate. He's too serious. Maybe Woody wasn't lying about him being a wooden doll. Let's go see what Gwen is up to. Actually, Gwen might be working as a storekeeper right now. Doesn't he already have a buzz cut? I don't know. Do you think she would like me if I, more if I shaved my head? Also, yeah, we're not a liar. Because we don't talk. It's kind of unsettling, actually. Alright, so who else can we go to? Oh, we can go to the villa, people. Uh, after that, we can head over to Bob's place. I guess, like, the shopping street. And I think that should cover everyone. We still haven't found Rudolph, by the way, but we'll find him later. Hi, Dia. Tell me about Liar's Day. Okay, yeah, we've heard the story before. You gotta love that, though. He was so stubborn that he just made every made it two Sundays in a row. Man, I would love a, a weekend where it was like two Sundays in a row. Oh, but I want to lie. Fine. Or is that a lie? Are you saying we should lie? Huh. Thank you, Dia, for letting me lie then. Yeah, but we can ask a bunch of people about the origins of Liar's Day. It's going to be the same exact story every single time, so... 
Then again, every one of them do tell it differently. Okay, that's a bit darker than the other tellings. Lila, were you actually there? Were you the lying baron? Okay, yeah, it's an old movie. It might be a lie or it might not be a lie. I don't know anymore. I don't know what to believe. Everyone is good. My sense of trust has been completely destroyed by Liar's Day. I don't have a well. I think Lila is, uh, enjoying this a bit too much. Alright, let's go see who else is around then. But man... Was, were all these stories that everyone told me a lie? Or were they real? Probably doesn't help that everyone's telling me, like, slightly different versions of it. Although, Lila's is the only one that involved a possible execution, so... We'll see. Anyone, is, uh, is Gina home? Gina and Martha should be home, I think. Hi, Martha. So you're not busy right now. I mean, they're both at Blue Hearts, but okay, fine. Unless she's lying to me. Maybe they love telling tall st uh, tales, but will only tell them to me if I'm not close to them. Tell me about the origins of Liar's Day. Is that a lie? Do you actually know? Today is a terrible day to trust people. Or is that a lie? Do you love it when I lie? Anyways, let's get out of here. This day is making me more and more paranoid as we go along. Uh, who else have we not met before? Oh, we still have to go find D or not Dia. Why can't I get on my horse? One second. There we go. Uh, we still need to go find Lewis and all the people on that street. Oh, and Bob! We need to go find Bob, duh. Hey, Bob. Yeah, he already kind of has a buzz cut. I don't know. Actually, that's probably not considered a buzz cut. Whatever. You're not wrong. They do moo at me a lot for some reason. I don't know. That one honestly sounds like it could be true. Mostly because for some reason, whenever I play, in this playthrough especially, my animals just do not stop making noise. They love to moo and bark at me. But I think that's everyone that we can easily find. Oh, we can also find Lewis, obviously. He's right here. Hi, Lewis. Oh, he's too nice. Or is he? Are you lying to me? Have you participated in Liar's Day before? I don't know who to trust. I'm going home. I can trust my dog. I think. Oh, actually, I forgot about some people. I forget. Do the Harvest Sprites lie today? I don't think they do. I've never actually tried this before. I'm not sure if they're home, though. Uh, let's find out. Hi guys, you're not home. Never mind. Uh, where would they be right now? They would probably be near the spring. So let's go see if we can find them then. We haven't found Rudolph. We haven't found Alice, but I think she locked herself in the office. Oh god. I think she locked herself in the office. We haven't found- we found Tim. Never mind. We found Ronald. Yeah, I think Rudolph is the one person we're missing. Found Woody. 
Oh, I still need to check my heart levels, too. Oh, and I should probably actually sell all the stuff I have on me. That would probably be a good idea. I kind of forgot to do that yesterday. Not the eggs. I'll keep the eggs for now. Yeah, I have no idea where Rudolph is right now, by the way. He kind of disappeared on me. Gotta be around here somewhere. Eh, we'll find him later. I'm trying to think if there's anyone else we forgot. Well, we forgot Ponta, but I'm pretty sure he won't lie to me. I hope. I trust him. Let's go see if we can find him real quick. It's already 3 o'clock. He should be spawning soon. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think we got everyone at this point. There's probably someone super obvious I'm missing, but meh. Because, yeah, we already found Lila. We found Louis. Hi, Ponta. Oh, he thinks it's an actual fe- Actually, I'm pretty sure that- Oh. I trust him. But I'm pretty sure that uh, first line is like a stock line he says every festival day. Even if there is one, even if there is like one like today. Or Earth Day. God, I hate Earth Day. Alright. But I think that's everyone, so let's just uh, head home and go to bed. And I think that's going to be it for this episode. So there is going to be a bit of a gap between this one and next one, unfortunately. But next time, we'll just... Wait. Winter's almost over. Huh. Never really realized just how close the end of winter is. And the end of year one, actually. Interesting. And we have not anywhere... Actually, we are pretty close to saving the valley, I think. Well, kind of. We haven't actually finished any ending paths yet, but we'll finish a couple eventually. So, next time on Let's Play Harvest Moon Hero Play Valley, we're gonna start preparing for spring again. So, till then. Also, I should feed my dog. <laughs>